A question I get all the time when uh, people find out that I play guitar is, do you play acoustic or electric? And I always find that question strange because uh, I play six strings, you know? So if it has six strings, then I'll probably be able to jam on it somehow. I mean, even this little deal, which I got it in Arizona for about, you know, five bucks. You know, even this little dinky thing, straight six strings, we'll figure some way to play it, right? I think most people, what they uh, consider as far as acoustics or electric would be uh, like a folk music kind of thing or, you know, a, a singer-songwriter kind of stuff. You know, just playing chords and such. But really, if you can, for the most part now, everything you can play on the electric, you should be able to play on the acoustic and vice versa. But I give the caveat, you're not going to be able to bend strings as much on the acoustic for most acoustics. You're not going to be able to get it as high for most acoustics. There are limitations on the acoustics that aren't on the electric. And there's some things on the electric that sound, I mean the acoustic, that sound really cool that aren't on the electric. When I'm on the acoustic, I tend to, kind of like if I ever play piano, which I rarely do, but if I do, I all, to, all of a sudden enjoy, you know, vibe this Elton John thing. I'm just doing love songs and sweet chords. You know, a little riff, you can be, should be in the new riffs and stuff like that. On the acoustic or the electric. So, if you're going to play either one, you should be adapted to either one because it, it doesn't change. The only thing that changes is the things that you can do with it. It doesn't change the fact that one has strings that you can bend a little bit more, one sounds a little bit more aggressive like this, and one sounds, you know, uh, folksier or, or it can be bluesier or whatever. It just has a different tonality. And even the electric Electric guitars have a different tonality, and I've got the distortion on right now. If I take that off, then that would uh, give me a different tone, and it would probably affect the way I play, because I uh, I personally play a lot off of tone and feel and that sort of thing. So if I took the uh, let's try, I'll take the distortion off of this thing, and. <laughs> A lot of times I'll play a little bit more of a, I don't want to call it funky, but you know, things that I would normally wouldn't play as electrified. Electric, I usually go to the top end and just start, you know, wailing out, which in this tone I really wouldn't, you know, pull off that well. But I still do the runs and everything. So, I don't know. I don't know why I'm doing this video. Just to let you know that uh, it's weird for me. You know, people ask you to play electric or acoustic. I, I just, I play guitar. That's what I play. Now, I understand the question of rhythm and lead, because not everyone that plays lead uh, does rhythm, like B.B. King, and not everyone that does rhythm plays lead. And there are a million of those out there, too, to give you an example. Most of the time, though, what I found is that if you could play lead, you could play rhythm. Not always great. I've known great, great lead players who are just average rhythm players, like Kirk Hammock, Metallica. And I've known great rhythm players who are just okay uh, lead players, like Michael Schenker. Not Michael Schenker, Rudy Schenker, his brother. Michael Schenker, he goes in the Kirk Hammock mode. Uh, great solo is not the greatest rhythm in the world. And then there are those that uh, play awesome rhythm, awesome lead, you know, Steve Vai, Joe Satrani. These are people that you know are just complete players. So uh, I don't know. I just thought I'd share this little uh, tidbit with you. If you play a guitar, you play guitar, right? So if you need any help playing lead, I'll help you out, man. Uh, but otherwise, let me know if you have any questions, comments. Uh, check out the blog. Check out the. Uh, I've got um, you know ebook that you can get. Pick up anything I can do to help you out. Let me know. Peace.